For nearly 20 years, the Wellfield Botanic Gardens in Elkhart have been a popular destination for both tourists and locals alike, but remains unfinished. Now with construction underway, a big expansion is on the horizon. The first phase of construction for Elkhart's Living Museum began on July 5th. In addition to the more than 20 existing gardens on Wellfield's 36 acres, their New Horizons program will see several all-new buildings and features added to what's currently a primarily outdoor venue. This was a project that has actually had its roots in the master plan from 2005 and the original founding of the garden. We have a series of over 20 different themed gardens around Wellfield, but there had also been a visitor center, an open air uh, pavilion, expanded parking, and the relocation and repurposing of our existing visitor's cottage. With weddings and concert rentals as some of the garden's primary sources of income, covered additions that protect from the elements are expected to significantly increase their financial bottom line. Being a place that sort of lives and dies by the weather, this really helps to hedge our bets and gives us more year-round effectiveness. The continuous growth of the gardens does come at a cost, though, $17 million to be exact. Although, thankfully, that money doesn't come at the expense of taxpayers. The gardens have been built by the generosity of the community. We're a nonprofit organization, so we don't get any um, tax dollars. So it's all privately funded. With 13 of the necessary $17 million already raised and construction well underway, the Gardens Board can now focus on implementing their community growth mission while improving their curb appeal and emphasizing the outdoor beauty that makes the gardens so special to begin with. And I think that when people see the visitor center, it's going to have more of a presence. You know, when you're driving by, people are going to notice it more. But then when they come in and see the gardens and see how beautiful it is, and I hope that they learn that this really is a community project and it's been built by the generosity of people that we live next door to. Taking it to the next level with this amazing project is only going to increase our impact and uh, positive impact in the community. The gardens will remain open throughout the renovation process, with the new additions set to be completed by the end of 2024. Reporting for Globe News, I'm Dante Stanton.